Hello again, it's Stephanie from Cupcakes and Sundry, and today I'm going to be making a pavlova. Now, pavlova is a traditional Australian dessert that I grew to love when I went to school in Australia. The pavlova I'll be making today is going to be covered with whipped cream and an assortment of berries. The ingredients needed to make the pavlova are one teaspoon of white vinegar, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, half a tablespoon of cornstarch, one cup of superfine sugar, and four egg whites. Here I have a stand mixer with the whisk attachment on. We're going to start by pouring the egg whites into the bowl. Turn your mixer on high and wait until your egg whites begin to look fluffy. At this time, you can start adding your sugar. Add your sugar at about one tablespoon at a time until all the sugar is incorporated. Your egg whites will look shiny and white at this point. Now you can start adding the cornstarch, vanilla extract, and white vinegar. Stop the mixer. Using a spatula, scrape down the sides of the bowl, making sure everything's mixed well. Turn the mixer back on high and watch until the egg whites look stiff about three to four minutes more. Once the egg whites are stiff, stop the mixer and look to see if the egg whites keep their shape. If not, continue mixing until stiff peaks form. Here I have a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. Using a spatula, scrape all of the egg whites onto the baking sheet, making a mound of egg whites. Smooth off the top of the meringue. The oven has been preheated to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Once the pavlova is inside, turn down the oven to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. After an hour and 15 minutes, open the door a little bit and turn off the oven. Let the pavlova sit for about 45 minutes or until fully cooled. Once fully cooled, take the pavlova out of the oven. We're now going to assemble it, but first we need to make some whipped cream. The ingredients we need are a half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, one tablespoon of sugar, and one cup of whipping cream. With the whisk attachment on, pour the whipping cream into the bowl. Whisk on high for about one minute. Add the sugar. And vanilla to the whipping cream. Continue whisking until the whipping cream is stiff and fluffy. Transfer the whipped cream onto the pavlova and top with berries or anything you'd like. And here's our finished blueberry, raspberry, and gooseberry pavlova. Nice and crisp on the outside, gooey and marshmallowy on the inside. Thanks for watching.